What's the key to staying connected when you're in a long distance relationship and you don't you get to see your partner? Second. Well, first of all, I think John O'Leary and Mel Robbins, we are the two best equipped people if we to can answer do this, this question. Anybody can. How long have you been married? We've been married 15 years. We've been married 22 years, and John has how many kids? We have four children. I have three children, <laughs> and uh, we are also on the road at least half the year. That's yeah, about that. Yeah, so, so I guess my secret is I text my husband all day long. I send him photos from the road. I honestly, I feel more connected to my kids sometimes when I'm traveling because they miss me, and they, they accept my FaceTime calls. And when I'm home, I notice Sorry. that they're and like, um, can I have some money in the car keys? I gotta go. And then when I try to FaceTime them or something, they're not. So I have longer conversations with right. them over FaceTime, but all kidding aside, I visually take them along mm. with me by taking photos and, and texting it. We have a family group chat mm -hmm. that I'm constantly texting in with them. We Snapchat a lot with the kids. Awesome. I don't know. I, yeah, oh, I know. I spend a lot of time acknowledging what Chris is doing because it blows to be the it's partner at much home. Much harder job. Much harder job. And we get, when you're traveling, you're distracted and going out to eat and bumping into fun people. When you're home, you're still doing the laundry and the kid shuffle and walking the dog, and so you can feel unappreciated. M Mel got a standing ovation today. So did you. Chris is at home cleaning up vomit right now, yeah. dog poop from the living room. It's a, Probably. It's a hard job. Yeah. So, so what do you do? What are your tricks to stay you know, connected? Technology, of course. So that's a wonderful way to do it. The best way I would suggest is when I'm home, like you can't call me. Work can't get me. I'm, I'm with her only. So for me, it's not about balance. It's about flow. But when I'm home, I'm completely engaged as a husband and as a dad and as a leader in life, I hope. And th that's one piece. The second is this. A couple years ago, we were struggling a little bit in our marriage. Not bad, yeah. but enough. And so I committed on January 1 to make a list of everything that Beth was doing right. Because I was finding myself making a list of things she was doing wrong. And this was a secret. So this is a, she just received this. <gasps> But um, on January 1, the 2nd, the 3rd, the 4th, for 360 days without her knowing it. And then on Christmas morning, she's opening up all the gifts and I never give her good gifts. I give her like hot red dresses that she can wear on Valentine's Day. It's, it's brutal. I never give her a good gift, but I gave her this old rusted out leather journal. And she opens it up January 1, January 2, there's a receipt from our dinner together, a couple trips that I we took together. I am stealing this idea. It was awesome, not only for her to receive it, but all year long, I was falling in love with what she was doing right rather than what she was doing wrong. And so I still do this now three years in. It's just an awesome thing that helps me remind myself how awesome my wife is. That is incredible. Your answer is way better than mine. <laughs> and I'm stealing this idea. Go for it. You'll love it. I love it. Awesome. Love it. Every single woman that's watching this just collectively went, <laughs> right. my husband is a jerk. He is a jerk. Make John, him do John, John is the winner. Maybe, so for the ladies, we might be jerks too, because maybe we can also acknowledge how great <laughs> the Chris's and the Steve's, the Roy's are in the marketplace. What do you focus on grows? So focus on the good and it's going to start magnifying. Awesome. Awesome. Wow. Oh, I love that. <laughs> yes. That's just not for heterosexual couples, too, by the way. That works for any That's couple any of any shape, size, kind, whatever. Yes, because we all want the same thing. Yes, we just we want to feel like we matter and somebody notices. That's a fact. Oh, my God. I'm stealing it. <laughs> You're the best. Love you, baby.